Hi there guys, my name is John from HomeKitAuthority.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to set up rooms within HomeKit. This is a part of a series of videos that will take you through how to use HomeKit and how to get the best out of Apple's smart home platform. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel as there'll be more videos coming out and it'd be also greatly appreciated. Also, if you've got a comment or a question, leave it below. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to check the description as there's a link to the website where you can find more HomeKit news and reviews. That's, thanks very much. Let's get straight into the video. Now, starting with setting up a room, I mean, there are various reasons why you'd want to, but the main reason is simply to organize devices and accessories within HomeKit. Now, I've got about 70 devices within my HomeKit setup, and it's a lot easier to have them organized across all the rooms that they're in, particularly if you've got a TV in a living room or blinds within a bedroom or something like that. You're able to also add them to scenes and automations, and it makes it a lot easier being able to get to devices by using the rooms tab. Now, I'll talk about scenes and automations in a later video, but in this video, I'm going to be talking about how to set up rooms. So first of all, you need to grab your iOS device and you need to open the OMAP. Now, once you've opened up the OMAP, you just simply go to the Rooms tab, which is on the bottom bar. You then press the icon with the three lines and three dots in the left corner, then tap Room Settings you'll find yourself in the rooms menu. Now you may have a room already in there that's already been created by HomeKit. If not, you click add own. Uh, once you've done that, you choose a name for the room. You also can choose a picture as well. So if you have taken a picture of that room or you want a picture, say if it's a children's room, it's, it might be a picture of your child, you can use that and then you can click save. Now, once you've set up the room, it's only as good as having the HomeKit devices. Now, I've already told you how to add rooms and I'll quickly tell you how to add a accessory to that room. Now, if you've got all your accessories, which should be in your default room, all you do is 3D press on the tile of that accessory, and then you go down to select room. You select the room and you click done. And that's it. So guys, thank you very much for watching this video. Hopefully you found it useful. If you've got a question or a comment, you leave it in the comment section below. If you want to subscribe to the channel, we'd greatly appreciate it. There's also well, loads of these, these videos coming out. And also check out the website. The link is in the description below. Thanks very much. I'll speak to you soon.